Welcome to Latest World News. The dramatic sell-off in China's main stock market has continued despite efforts by regulators to try to stem the losses. The Shanghai Composite Index plunged 8% on opening, taking the drop in share values to 30% since their June peak. On Wednesday, another 500 listed firms said they would stop trading their shares in an effort to insulate themselves from the meltdown. Around 1,300 firms have halted trading, almost half of China's main shares. Big chief market strategist Chris Weston dubbed the sell-off Black Wednesday. For the first time, the China Insurance Regulatory Commission CERC, has admitted there is genuine panic selling underway. When we see around 90% of the market suspended or falling by their daily limit, while further measures have been taken to limit the influence seemingly exerted by futures traders, you know things are becoming less rational, he said. Chinese regulators made a string of pledges on Wednesday to try to ease the panic sentiment in the market. The cabinet agency that oversees China's biggest state-owned companies said it had told them not to sell shares and to buy more in order to safeguard market stability and the CERC pledged to make more money available to brokerages from its state-backed margin finance firm. Investors in China rely on margin financing from these brokerages to borrow money to buy stocks. Insurers were also given the go-ahead to invest more in blue-chip stocks, with the industry watchdog raising limits from 5% of their total assets up to 10%.